Hi, what's good everybody? It's your boy Call Ice Zone. We're back here with another moving video. Today we're in the semi-finals between One Piece and Demon Slayer. This one's gonna be crazy because we're leading up to the final match. We have two teams who are very underrated. Everybody thinks Fade's gonna win. Can either of these teams show up and show some crazy ass action? Let's find out. First we got One Piece, leaded by the new Luffy and a whole lot of crazy new people on the team. Secondly, we have Demon Slayer. They have a lot of strong people as well, but they might not be able to take down Fate as well as One Piece. Both of these teams are very underrated, nobody thinks they can be able to take them down. And also have an announcement, One Piece will not have all the characters that are, have been sent because this video was pre-recorded, but they will have them if they win this round. But I hope y'all enjoy. Let me know down below if y'all enjoy this video. And like I said, every video, let's get right into the action. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Ice, and we're back here with the Tournament of Anime semifinals, the final match before the finals, basically. And this one's going to be a very, very, very exciting video. I feel like this is going to be a very, very tough video just because both sides have great hitters across both lines. I feel like this could go either way. I honestly, me personally, I have no idea who's going to win this, man. I, I, I literally don't know. I, I, I could see it going either way in all regards. We're going to start it off with something actually different. I could start it off with the Strongest were the strongest or the weakest versus the weakest yet. We're going to start it off with something a little different today. We're going to be putting Sanji versus Muzan off the rip. Muzan being one of the strongest on the team, probably the second strongest. And then we have Sanji, the second strongest on the One Piece team. So, like, as I said, this is probably going to be a, um, a great fight. But let's get right into it, honestly. I I'm excited to see the matchup. I'm excited to see who's going to be going to the finals versus, versus Fate, man. Fate is a problem of a team. One Piece are some monsters as well. So is Demon Slayer, who has been upgrading almost every single tournament. But can they take down, um, you know, One Piece? Can they take down One Piece before we even think? Can anybody be Fate? We'll, we'll wait to see if anybody even beats One Piece or not or Fate. I mean, D Demon Slayer. You got to worry about this match. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! And Muzan takes round one. Sanji couldn't even get a transformation off. Holy, Muzan is one of them. That was just like 100 to 0 right there. Sanji, you better start popping your your your, your shit faster, bro. No kids. Oh, Sanji might get 100 to 0 again. No way he gets 100 to 0 to start that video off. Two times in a row would be crazy. Yeah, he did. Wait, no, he didn't yet. And Sanji didn't transform... He tried to get a kickoff on Muzan. Oh my god. Muzan just no diff Sanji basically full health. Oh no, that's one way to start the video off, y'all. That's that's actually insane. We gotta bring it back. We're gonna be putting that boy. We're gonna do strongest versus strongest. Now we're gonna be. I finally found out what y'all wanted me to find out. We're gonna be putting the, the strongest Kizaru power nine against um Yorichi. You guys were begging me to find this out. You guys sent me all the tips and everything. So we finally can see how strong this Kizaru is since y'all y'all told me about him. I put him against Kizaru. Kizaru still beat him. But he actually did destroy a whole lot of stronger characters that he couldn't beat before. So this, this Kizaru is definitely way stronger. And I'm using literally um the highest mode. This is literally the strongest Kizaru. What the fuck is going on? There we go. I don't know if Power 9 Kizaru is glitched. But for some reason, I don't know what's going on. Yurichi hit him? I don't know what's going on, y'all. Y'all might have to let me know down in the comment section. Is this fight glitched or something? What the hell's going on? Oh, so he can hit. Yurichi can hit him. It's just he has hyper armor. Okay. So he has some good hyper armor on him. Okay. I can see that Kizaru is taking damage. He's just not getting knocked back. But Kizaru looks like he's missing a lot of hits too. I want to restart the match, but I don't want to restart it mid-fight. I might have to though, because it looks like... I don't know what's going on. Let's just get right back to the match again. But they literally couldn't hit each other. I don't know what's going There we go. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's, that's the wrong fucking Kizaru. <laughs> I'm an idiot. My bad. That's the uh, regular Kizaru. I forgot I had to put him in his power. 
Nine power keys. All right, let's see, let's see this go again. All right, so it looks like they. It looks like your Kizaru's taking damage. He just has a good amount of hyper armor on him. This is an insane battle though to start the video off. Definitely pretty damn crazy. Yeah, Kizaru's taking damage. It's literally just uh that hyper armor on him. His hitboxes are really weird, so he kind of it's hard for him to hit some. Well, that move right there, he should have hit, but I don't know. That was weird. I don't know. I literally don't know what's going on. There's something literally wrong with Kizaru. They're in the corner fighting now, and it's like, what the fuck is going on? Kizaru takes around one. That's a makeup for the match that we ended, but that's just like, that's really weird that they uh, have like a really hard time hitting each other. It's very close. It looks like Yoruichi could end up taking this, but at the same time, it looks like um, Kizaru's putting his work in, so I don't know. This move would do a good amount of damage if he could hit it, but for some reason, he's, like, really missing it. He's having a hard time hitting a lot of his moves in this 9 power state that y'all sent me. Because before, he really didn't have too much of a hard time using his moves, but for some reason now, it's giving him, like, he's, like, really, really hard for him to hit. And then y'all know this Yorichi is definitely a very aggressive character, so... Oh, this is gonna hit. That's gonna hit. Ooh, how much damage? Oh, it didn't hit. It looked like it was going to hit. That's a great damage. Yeah, that's going to hit no matter what. That move always hits. Oh, he used it again. That was smart. That was definitely smart. That's literally doing a lot of damage to Yorichi every time he uses it. Oh, that's a big AoE, but it missed. Oh, Yorichi always... Yorichi starts out so good every time. But then, he's always just starts to bring it back. With that hype arm he has. Oh, Yorichi's auto-dodging. Okay. I see him with a little auto dodge. That's just tough. And Kizaru takes the round. He had a that was a very intense fight. Oh my god! But as y'all seen, Yurichi did end up falling. Now we're gonna be doing um, we're gonna be putting Kokushibo versus Luffy. Two strong ass characters. I can see this literally going either way as well. Where these are both um some of the stronger characters on the team. Definitely not the weakest on each side. But we're gonna see how uh how this goes. Where's my boy Kokushiba? I would have put um, Tanjiro against Luffy just because main characters most of the time. But as y'all know, we literally don't have any one of them. So. so let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. All right. Oh, Luffy starting off with his, uh, his, his observation hockey. Okay, that's a smart way to start it out. Oh, Gear 4 Snake Man is one of those combos where he literally could just get rid of you off the rip. Uh, that's not that's ha something hard but as y'all know kokushibo has a lot of counters them counters really could get kokushibo what he wants to get when he wants to get them holy shit kokushibo is kind of fighting luffy and hurting luffy without any without any pain really he's like just he's going insane he said i don't even need to transform for you no way this is not even a transformation fight no because luffy's a monster he beat jotaro does that mean Kokushibo is that much higher of a level than all of them? No, he's not. He might be. We did see this Kokushibo beat Muzan, too, so this this character is very, very strong. Oh, nah. And Demon Slayer, dude, they're taking their stances. This might look bad for uh, One Piece right now. And yeah, Kokushibo is popping his little mode right here. He might not even have to pop his real form because Luffy literally just can't keep up with the guy. Okay. Holy shit, that nigga was hitting Odin and Luffy for a second. <laughs> oh my god, Kokushibo got mad and started beating the shit out of Odin too. He said, why did you come here? I'm about to say, he should pop Bounce Man honestly because I feel like Bounce Man can give him a chance at winning this. But Snake Man's not getting him the win right now. He needs to fight harder than he is. Maybe pop hockey, yeah. No hockey is definitely getting him a hard match right now. Yeah, Kokushiba. I can't see Kokushiba losing here. He has he's having an easy time. He's completely destroying Luffy. And Kokushibo takes the W. Oh my god, this is getting ridiculous. We are now gonna go into Doflamingo versus Nitsu. This is like at this point, Demon Slayer needs a dub here. And y'all send me this news to Nitsu. Y'all are telling me he needs to be in the video. Get him. 
So I'm here with him, and we're going to see if he's strong enough to take out the Noodle Flamingo. This character is a monster. He's fast. We did get to see him, and I, I, I want to see if he can take down the Noodle Flamingo. Okay, at, from what I'm seeing right now, he's getting boxed in that corner. Holy shit. Oh my god. He's getting boxed. Holy shit, he's getting boxed. This is not looking good at all. And Doflamingo just no diffs Zenitsu. Oh my god. And we know this Zenitsu is strong. Y'all sent it to me. I, I literally seen he has some pretty good moves. There we go. Thunderclap and Flash. But that hyper armor, the hyper armor makes his Thunderclap and Flash almost basically useless. The M1's okay. Ooh. He's basically like hyper armor dodging the, the Thunderclap and Flash. Yeah, that range that Zenitsu has is literally working against him with Doflamingo. Doflamingo's not one of them. Oh, man. This is looking bad. Doflamingo's completely counteracting Zenitsu. We might go to a round, a final round with the Zenitsu and Demon Slayer versus, um... Oh, Thunderclap and Flash. I mean, Godspeed mode. He's in Godspeed mode. Oh, Zenitsu's not playing any games. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh my God. The Nitsu's putting in pain right now. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, Zenitsu. Zenitsu breathing. Regenerative breathing. Oh, no. Zenitsu's going insane right now. He said, I'm not letting the Demon Slayer team lose here. We're going to the finale. We're going to the finale. I, Zenitsu, I'm, I'm proud of you. But Don Flamingo, you're going to lose here? And Don Flamingo loses round one to Zenitsu. I mean, round two, actually. Oh, so they're going to a final round even in this fight. Okay. Okay. The Nitsu is getting hurt. All those Thunderclap and Flashes aren't bad, but he literally can't use those Odo Flamingo. He needs to realize that early and pop it, pop something else. It's not working. Oh, wait. What is this? Oh, he's dropping his little Thunderclouds. Okay. Oh, that hurts. What is this right now? Oh. Oh. And Doflamingo pushes it to a final match. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. We're on a 2-2 right now. 2-2. Two, two. And now we're going to go into the final match. We're putting Whitebeard versus Tokito. Two monster of characters. This is looking crazy. And Tokito take down Whitebeard, the man himself. This will be the final match. Tokito defeated Doma, so he took his spot. And now we have Whitebeard. The man who just beat... Oh, no, this map is... I don't like this map. But the man who just beat um Gior, Not Who did he fight? He fought somebody pretty damn strong. Poochie. The man beat Poochie. So this is not an easy match no matter what. This is a high-dip fight regardless. Look at the size difference, man. I can see that it's going either way. I can see it's going either way. Oh, Tokito Pop missed. This is, this is where it starts becoming a problem. Because he has the auto-dodge in the mist. Ooh, ooh, but he can still get hit. Whitebeard is still hitting. Whitebeard is still hitting. Oh my god, Tokito is putting in that damage. But will it be enough? Will it be enough to take down the legendary Whitebeard? Ooh, ooh. And Whitebeard takes down Tokito for round one. Tokito was putting in a good fight, but Whitebeard might just be a little bit too much for Tokito. Oh, we're going into miss mode. We're going into miss mode. We're going into miss mode early. Oh, this is looking this is looking bad for Whitebeard. Whitebeard up close is like he's strong, but Tokito it might be have it up close. Ooh, hockey into hyper armor. Okay. Hockey into hyper armor is definitely what you want to see here. Oh, Tokito better be careful. He doesn't have his auto dodge on anymore. That's going to hurt. Everything that Whitebeard uses is going to hurt him right now because he's not popping auto dodge. There we go. Uh, he got his miss back up. He got his miss back up. Ooh, this is close. This is close. This is close. No, this is close. Oh, my God. We're going into a final, final match. Oh, nah. These Both of these teams want to be in the finale. Who's taking it? Demon Slayer versus One Piece right now. Whitebeard's knocking Tokito back. No, he's not. <clears throat> Hockey. Okay. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts. Everything Whitebeard throws out hurts. 
That's the thing about Whitebeard. If he hits you with something, it's gonna hurt. And he has tankiness. He has that tankiness on his side. So it's Tokito is getting with Whitebeard right now. Whitebeard's having a hard time because Tokito is literally just a tiny man who's so fast. Oh, we're going into miss mode. This might be it for Whitebeard. Wait. Wait a minute. Is it it for Whitebeard, though? Literally, this could be. This could be it for Whitebeard. We, just not, we don't know yet. Whitebeard can't even be all aggressive as he usually is. They're both about the same health right now. Oh. Oh, my God. Tokito. No. Is Tokito going to lose here? Will, will Demon Slayer be done here? And Demon Slayer loses to One Piece in the final round, man. Demon Slayer put their amazing work in. They get my huge, huge respect, man. They went insane. But I hope y'all enjoyed that standard video. I hope y'all, like, like I said, man, the finals is coming. One Piece versus Fate. Who's winning? Let me know down below what y'all think. Iso right, so gang, we out of here.